Welcome everyone to me and Ryan's 100 day survival in a Minecraft zombie apocalypse. 100 days in Minecraft, now that is a really long time, especially with two people, it makes it a bit harder. We didn't play on hardcore, that way we could actually take some risk here and there because uh, when I watch people play on hardcore, they usually play really carefully, which makes sense. But at the same time, we wanted to add some risk, you know, we wanted to do stupid stuff and not have to pay for it by ending the whole series. But yeah, let us go ahead and hop into the first couple of days here because the first week or so was pretty eventful. Day one. Zombie apocalypse. You're getting, you're getting awfully close to them. Oh damn, they're falling. You see the brown building right there? They're breaking out of that one window in the brown building. We got vehicles in this mod pack. We got post-apocalyptic weaponry. We got guns. And most importantly, we have zombies that drop slime because slime is the main part of weapons, apparently. <laughs> All right, we're, we're, not allowing, we're not allowing Minecraft swords. Oh, it's a chest right here. I might snag this. There's nothing in it. <laughs> The spawner's in here. I'm getting out of here. No, I'm trying to cut down a tree, bro. Oh, yeah. Steel pipe. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Fucking wolves. I'm going in the building. Uh. Okay. I think there's something invisible attacking me. I don't know what the invisible things are. Dude, oh, they were underneath me. Holy shit, there's so many underneath me. So for our first couple of days, we had to deal with an invisible mob attacking us. Now, we had no idea what the invisible mob was. We were assuming that it was a mob that wasn't disabled and it just didn't have a texture because it wasn't disabled because the only mobs that are supposed to be able to spawn is just zombies and passive mobs. So obviously that was a problem. Another problem I'm noticing while starting to edit this is that Ryan's audio did not get captured the whole entire series. A little upsetting, but uh, you know, probably a majority of this video will be post commentary so maybe you guys won't even notice but other than the invisible mob being a problem day one was not too bad oh oh i found all the zombies hello uh i'm going back on the roof oh shit zombies are funneling out of this building i gotta go i'm out of here oh my god i'm on my toes i stay on my tiptoes like a ballerina i gotta stop this spawner before it gets out of control because I'm a man. Never mind, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> there was just one zombie next to the spawn. It was doable, but once the second one came out, uh, I wasn't dealing with that. Hey, I got a furnace. I stole one. What you want, boy? My boy got the sweater on. I see him. The hoodie. He got the COVID mask. Ah! Oh, more cows. Let's go. Oh, no. It's a little early for that. Damn, look at that moon. That really is blood red. They weren't lying. Perfect. <laughs> I'm gonna look at the uh, what's this? Is it? What happened? Oh, there's an invisible one. What? Why is there an invisible one? I don't get it. I found a really cool building and another crater. Ah! The fucking fast zombie was on my ass. Can I just eat mushrooms raw? Oh! Perfect. Oh, there's a lot of zombies. How are you guys doing? Oh, there's a zombie on the top. <laughs> yeah, we were close enough. Oh, shit. Fast zombies are on me. Oh, I found the subway system. Dude, the fast zombies are the worst. Ah! I don't have a weapon. I have a pickaxe and I don't want to waste his durability. <gasps> oh, my, I made it. Boom, baseball bat. Let's get it. Y'all trying to battle? Got his ass. Oh! Dude, there's an invisible one. I think I know what the invisible ones are. I think they're babies. Ow, ow! It set me on fire too. What the fuck? Might have other problems soon. Oh, no, it is near. We gotta block up. Block up somewhere. <laughs> he wrote the block you're standing up. <laughs> 
Okay, we might have to look, we might have to make an executive de- decision here. As in, we might have to take a second to figure out why the fuck the baby zombie's invisible. So obviously, this invisible mob is a problem. Don't worry, we figure it out. It wasn't baby zombies, but it was a mob spawning from another mod that added in a zombie, and just for some reason, it was invisible. I, I don't know why. I ended up going through and disabling literally everything but regular zombies. So that's how we got it working in the end. But yeah, we're gonna go slow with the first couple of days here because these are some of the most entertaining moments is in the first couple of days. There'll be moments later on where we literally spend like five days mining or like just five days working on our home. So like if we're going slow paced here at the beginning, you know why. Damn, the dude's on the tree. Look at this guy. That boy. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Get off. Scared the shit out. He wasn't even after me. What a kind fella. See, some of these zombies are fucking, they're really uh, misrepresented. Okay, never mind. He just wanted to go out the window. <laughs> oh, where are you going now? You trying to run away now? I hear the living dead. Do the dead really be living though? Can we get a fuck Ryan in the chat? But there is a lot of moves in here. <laughs> Oh, that's why. Oh, those are fast zombies. <laughs> I was wondering why they all look the same or look like regular zombies. That's bad. I don't want to be in here. Holy shit. <gasps> They're zooming around the corner. That's terrifying. Dude, there's so many chests down there. But there's also, I'm counting like 30 fast zombies <laughs> just running around. <laughs> They're so quick. Day six. When you guys watch the actual video, we're going to be like, days 10 through 20, we didn't do anything. You do that? Oh my god. They got pickaxes. Do, do, do. They're not getting blocked off. Perfect. Gamer move has been accomplished. Let's see the forward down there. I'm going to break the ladder, <laughs> and then I'm going to turn down to that. Have fun. I think if we go the direction you're facing, that's like, oh my god, I fell into like a fucking cave. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh my god, he's fast as shit. Oh, I hit him with a water that Oh my god. <laughs> I'm on his ass. Oh, there's another one, there's another one. <laughs> you gotta get him for me. We'll do circles on him. No, lag spike. What's up, bitch? Drive by. Ow. Where's he at? Bitch. <laughs> now this is how they did it in The Walking Dead. Oh shit. <laughs> It's a pack of coyotes. <laughs> There's a lot of coyotes in the savannah. I don't know if I like this area. Whoa, that's up. Going back to the highway. Oh, fuck. Scary, I'm out of here. Oh my god, there's a lot of tarantulas, dude. This place is terrible. I don't know. Oh, I got DC. Server class. <laughs> Something at the end of the tunnel. This is a zombie. This is like, <laughs> this is like the, the opening shot right here. Oh, oh! Look at this. There's a narwhal in here. <laughs> a little like pit of water. Oh, he's trying to circle. He's trying to circle. That's how you clear out an area right there. I think I'm gonna live in this gray building that literally leads into water or leads into the narwhal water because like that means I only have like two sides that I have to worry about. All right, so this is where me and Ryan decided to choose our home and start fortifying it. Now we chose this building because it had a giant pit of water and we thought, you know, that would keep us safe. So let's build with the pit of water being one of our defenses. Little did we know that pit of water would cause so much trouble in the future. Oh, he fell into the moat. <laughs> they're falling into the moat. Oh, they're smart. They knew I was trying to push him into the moat. I'm taking this horde on. Ah, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Dude, this is bad. <laughs> How did this horde get so out of control? Ah, look at him. They're in the moat, dumbass. <laughs> Oh god, there's some in here. Oh god, there's some in here. Oh look, I found Smith is 99 zombie. <laughs> He's got a bat on him. I see you with the baseball bat. <laughs> You're about to jump in. The baseball bat? No! <laughs> I don't have a feather. Fuck. Can you check that chest and throw down a feather? <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> oh yes, it's time. You guys are about to be in for it. We need like a shark to spawn in here. We got the narwhal. <laughs> we need like a shark. Maybe we just need lava. Oh my god, that guy tried jumping at me. This might be it. Boom! Oh, this is working well. Boom! Nice. 
Oh my god. <laughs> That's so many. Oh damn. There's eels in the water. I don't know if they're attacking the zombies. They might be helpful though. Alright, let's see. Okay, it seems like a weaker version of the other. Might be cheaper, but... Yeah, it seems weaker. The eels slowly clearing things out. Shout out to them. Big help. Much appreciated. Day 12. All right. Let me work on my uh, snow golems here. This should work. There we go. It's on a little, like, turret tower. Don't jump out, you dumbass. Oh, my God. He just jumped right out. He's, they're not even throwing snowballs. Wait. Ah! Do they not throw snowballs at these zombies? I don't think they I don't think they do. Alright, well, I tried my best with that. <laughs> Perfect. Work as designed. Hey, welcome. Go ahead, hop on in everybody. I don't know where you're coming from, but welcome. So days nine through fifteen, we kind of just try to build up our defense for our home. Other than that, we didn't really do too much. Things are gonna start picking up here though. We should be going through the days much faster. So for the next couple of days, me and Ryan tried to clear out some of the buildings and try to get rid of some of the spawners. The spawners do break after they spawn in seventy-five zombies though. I did cap it at that. That's still a lot of zombies. But yeah, after a couple of failed attempts of clearing the buildings we went ahead started up some farms tried to get things going you know some regular minecraft stuff so we could survive for the long term all right let's say uh you you get to work on the potatoes and carrots i'll get to work on the sheep gathering oh look there's sharks i don't know where where the fuck like they're going crazy oh shit right here oh look at that we got a little horde down here you're ruining my fucking sheep farm where did they spawn from bro look at this i know i'm following one right now where the fuck am i <laughs> why did they do this i found a whole ass cave system dude they came from the fucking mines or from the subway system this might be like that original group that chased us down when we were in here you got a shark coming towards you oh my god that shark came oh my god the shark is doing work now you lifeless zombie undead bitch Oh my god, I'm about to die. That dude accelerated out of nowhere. This is the first time I just ran off. Oh, I found dogs. Dog. Uh. You're not wrong about the dying immediately. They, I, I tamed them and they're fighting each other. What is happening? Why are all the dogs fighting? <laughs> this dog says I'm racist or some shit. Because they do not fuck with this dog. They're just all fighting. What is happening? Are you trying to sneak up on watching dogs fight? Fucking zombie bitch. Winner! We have a winner! Doom, doom, doom! You're coming with me! It's chest over here. I don't give a fuck if it's not. Ah! Okay, I do care. I do care. I can head around 300 zombies. <laughs> Day 21. Who's gonna burn? I know some of you. Oh, some of them are burning. This might be something. The electrified iron fence acts the same as a vanilla fence, except it is unbreakable and will hurt anyone but the owner when they get in contact with it. Hold up. That might be something. It just costs iron and a fence. There's a pig. Oh, the animals are getting out. Who the fuck broke that block? Ah! Oh my God. I placed a block and then they just started breaking it immediately. And I was about to jump to that block. Holy <laughs> I hate when they dig. What are you digging down here? It's just one of them. Oh, look at the clicking. Absolutely perfect clicking. So days 25 to 33, this is when we head into the mines because we want to get some materials to make us some guns. Because to survive a zombie apocalypse, you know, you're going to need some guns for the big hordes. Or I guess if you just want to mess around, which is kind of what we want to do. <laughs> An interesting way to die. I got to climb up. And then when I climb up, I gotta climb here. Dude, what the fuck? You fucked up my only way to get to the roof. And then you try and kill me. Oh, I can handle this. Oh, bikini bitch. They're trying to bless me down here. Do I have a celebrity crush? Smith this 99. I'm just kidding. He's not a celebrity. I think I heard a villager down here. Not a regular villager. But I heard a... Her. Oh, I heard it again. <laughs> I don't think it's a regular villager though. I think it's that motherfucker, an archaeologist. I hear him. I just oh oh, there's a uh, whoa, there's a door down here. What the fuck? Hello. He trades emeralds for bones. Okay. Gunpowder for emeralds. 
emeralds for diamonds how interesting <laughs> look how big this copper ink it is all right we take this go like this boom 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 hands up just kidding i don't have ammo and then we go like this oh shit i think it's finally time we can shoot zombies Jesus Christ, that took a lot of shots. Here you go. <laughs> Good shooting. I finally set my eyes on diamonds. So for the next set of days, our next goal was to set up an electric fence perimeter. The thing that was hard about this is every electric fence, just one fence costs four iron. So obviously things get a little expensive. I have an idea what we could do or work on other than your gat. Electric fences. Finally get some set up around the house perimeter, at least the house. Why every time I take out the gun, I have to stop doing that. Stop doing it. It's not how... You know, break the gun doing that. Oh, zombies underneath me and they're breaking the block underneath me. I don't know. I'm here and digging. It's kind of scary. That dude had an enchanted shovel and he dropped it. <laughs> Ow. Iron shovel efficiency one and the durability is about to break. Boom. Sentry has been crafted. Damn eel in a little tiny pool of water. Oh, that eel died real quick. Let us see what effect. Darkening. Oh. Casimir's black now. What the heck? What? Hold up. Does this mean I can say it? <laughs> watch you from above. Gather up a little horde and bang on them. Oh, watch out. They're coming from behind. They're trying to flank. Bumper car. <laughs> We're not making bumper cars. <laughs> Lawn floor. <laughs> Mini bike. Mini bus. 128 ingots. A bus would be nice. Fit multiple. Off roader. That would fit multiple. Shopping car. <laughs> Smart car. <laughs> so I think either we want dirt bikes if we want to quickly like weave through areas. And then we want probably a multi person vehicle. So we go. Let's do dirt bikes first. Gunshots fired. Help. All right. Are you ready for this right here? Whoa. Hey. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. I flew off. <laughs> <laughs> we're good we're good we're good well that was the plan anyways was to jump off but not on accident oh yeah Skirt. <laughs> oh ow 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 boom boom ow let's go find some good caves oh <laughs> hey oh wait there's a hole right here hey yeah, you're a little too close. You can, you can scoot back if you want. My wolf teleported me. <laughs> he's back. I don't know where he's been this whole time. <laughs> don't die. You are a legend. Straight through this bird. I can't see. <laughs> where did I end up? How did I end up so deep down here? Uh, there's zombies down here. Oh, this is bad. This has got, this got real bad. Wolf! <laughs> How did my dog die? All right, we are coming up on days 50 through 74. This is a giant chunk here. We spent a majority of the days, of course, mining again because it takes a lot of materials just to make guns. Not only the guns, but the ammo too. On top of that, we also finally tried to cover up the giant water hole because that thing was causing more harm than it was safety to us. So now when we're out adventuring, we don't have to worry about our spawn being reset. We got a sleeping bag, you know, look. So zombies do not drop a couple of pieces of iron. Ah, ah. Hopefully they don't find a way up here. I need to unload the clip, reload the clip, put the clip back in. Oh shit, he's coming. Bang, bang. Bang, bang, bang. I definitely tapped into a horde over here or a spawner. Got a nice horde here, like legit, like 20. There is something trying to get me. They <laughs> keep coming. That guy's holding a pickaxe. Uh oh, there's so many zombies. I just want to mine and craft. And there you go. That has to be 75 zombies because there's no way. The spawner broke. I have a stack of iron from killing them. <laughs> nice. Oh. Hey, you boys. How you doing? Yeah, I'm breaking the floor. Good luck trying to get over here. Oh, my God. They almost made the jump. Oh. <gasps> 
She got the heart of a diamond, which means I can make a pickering. Now I can mine from a foot away. How do I do with like this fucking horde, bro? There's <laughs> so many. And boom, out of it. Oh, fuck. Oh. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. I think it's time that I just let this boy unleash. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This thing does good damage. I love it. They keep dying and picking up this enchanted armor. Give me that shit. <laughs> this is my enchanted armor now. I have one chicken egg. I'm going to throw it into the pen here. And if a chicken spawns, I'll gift a sub. It is <laughs> I don't like that the sharks here. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. There's a spawn in here. Has to be. I'll take you all on. Where's the spawner at? I see it. Ow, ow, ow. I see it. Ow. I'm getting pushed back. Ow. I have a half a heart. Oh. <laughs> you want to fight, huh? Damn shark. Whoa. <laughs> Stop making that noise. You ready for this? Boom! We got some wings. I'm kind of scared to fly. <laughs> I don't want to crash. I can't be too, too bad. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's only a forward right now. Okay, uh, I've taken off. <laughs> this is cool as fuck. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Just uh, slow down a little bit. There you go. Nice. Good landing. It's a little scary to fly. I'm not going to lie. It's really fast. Maybe I shouldn't have put a gold engine. I'm feeling the carabiner. One of these type weapons. Oh, yes. Go ahead and go uh, land it next to near mine. WSD. S is a slow down. Space. Go higher. <laughs> nice. Good landing. Oh, shit. I'm already flying. <laughs> I'm taking nice and slow. I'm not going to press W. Just going to use space. Uh oh. Kind of going down. Oh, this is like a whole different perspective. What the heck? Did you jump out? <laughs> fly up. Fly up. Fly up. Oh, shit. Too, too fast. Too fast. There's a chest on this top floor. I'm landing on this building and I'm checking it out. Hello. Hello. Oh, hey. How you doing? Got a spawner. See you later, bitch boy. Oh, I don't like that. Where did you even come from? Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Damn, that guy broke the whole tree. And he despawned as soon as he broke the tree. Boom. Oh, yes. So those days, aka 74 through 90, were pretty lackluster. We're pretty geared up at this point, so it's pretty rare that we die. Unless you're Ryan and you're jumping out of planes for some reason. Days 90 through 100. So to spice up the finale, I added in the mutant creature mod. Or mutant monsters, mutant beasts, I don't know. It's gone through a couple different names. But I added in the mod, which adds in a bunch of stronger versions of Minecraft mobs. Aka mutated versions. I I meant to just add the zombie but I, it got really fun when all of them started attacking us so enjoy the last 10 days they're next to each other oh that boy got the nike sweater on how is the nether oh there's a fucking mutant enderman in here oh my god there's dogs running at me uh, i'd be careful with those guys well that's that's an option though okay. oh I think I fucked up. <laughs> I think I looked at the end of it. <laughs> Ow! I got range on him. What the fuck? I have fucking two and a half hearts. Is he in the wall? <laughs> Ow, he keeps hitting me. I don't have enough health. The potion that mutates them into the big ones. Just kill him. Did he die? <laughs> he did something. He's dead somewhere. We gotta find his loot. Ow. Oh my god. I can't see. Ah, man, where am I? 
He puts you in the floor. Bro, we're how deep? I'm deep in the floor. I thought he places blocks. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, he died, he died! That's his death animation? Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, finale's a finale. Wait, no, I see something down there. Is that the egg? <laughs> the egg might be on our side. Ow! That zombie has a fucking s sword or something, bro. It does have a sword. That shit almost one-tapped me. Uh, the water current is too strong. I got the creeper egg. I have the creeper egg. I'm bringing it to safety. Oh, shh. <laughs> He's a yoink. He, he just yoinked your ass. Oh. I love that one. Dude. What? <laughs> I was wearing a pumpkin. The laws of Minecraft. The laws of Minecraft. Oh, no. Oh. Never mind, never mind. He's at the fence. He's at the fence. He's staring at me. He's just staring at me. Can you stop breaking the fucking stairs? Is he dead? Oh, he's getting back up. He's getting back up. Dude, I'm getting attacked by something. It's the turret that's attacking me. So I think the mutant zombie, if you don't burn him, he revives. And then if you kill him a couple of times, he stays permanently dead. There you go, knocked his ass down again. This this one is getting a little close. <laughs> oh. But he's looking at you. Ah. Fucker. Hey, this is a creeper on our building. Oh my god, there's a lot of mean zombies now. There's a lot of mean zombies now. <laughs> when did it get so bad? We need a flint and steel stat. Oh, he dropped a hammer. There's a fucking... <laughs> there's a mutant skeleton. I'm hit, I'm hit. Why is it taking so long to eat? Nice, good shit. <laughs> we need the flint and steel and we burn him. There you go. Lay down and hit him with it. There's a creeper. <laughs> The creeper blew up our plane. Oh no, we're good, we're good. Uh <laughs> Oh no, we're good, we're good, we're good. I think No <laughs> <laughs> He fucking nuked me. Oh <laughs> There's a, there's a couple of creepers just kinda of roaming outside of the building. I saw, I saw our plane go flying. <laughs> to escape the zombie apocalypse that is just constantly overrunning us, me and Ryan decided to hop in our planes and fly off into the sunset, hoping to find some new lands unpopulated by mutated zombies, giant skeletons, and a bunch of other things. But that officially will end our 100 days in a Minecraft zombie apocalypse. Make sure you guys leave a like if you want to see more. Hey, we're going to do more whether this video bombs or whether it bangs. We do have some good ideas coming up. I do plan to do single player and multiplayer ones. Shoot, maybe even some for Terraria. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Make sure to check out Ryan's perspective. Not only did he have both of our voices, unlike me, but he has a different ending. I might show a little bit of that different ending right here but yeah thank you guys again i'll see y'all next time